Hello everyone, welcome to the channel again and here is another video and today we are going to make crepes and here are the ingredients so we will make banana crepe and here are bananas eggs we have here here is sugar flour we have vanilla essence we have fresh milk we have milk powder we have bicarbonate of soda we have salt and oil and in this video you will see how we will make very delicious crepes and you can have these crepes for your breakfast or you can have them for your tea time so please keep watching the video and I hope you will like this video okay to start these crepes you have to start with bananas so we take bananas here we're going to build them we will use three bananas for this one. three bananas there and we are going to blend everything see here is our blender and Make sure the bananas are very well blended so you don't have lumps of bananas inside which is not good when you're cooking the crepes they have to be really fine yeah and i will add some fresh milk here let's see yeah. fresh milk fresh milk Vanilla, see here, vanilla, vanilla extract. Vanilla extract is there already, and we are going to add eggs. And to this, I'm going to add three eggs. Okay, we have three eggs in there and we are going to blend this. We are going 
sugar, any sugar, and we will add five spoons of sugar. This is sweet crepes, so I'm putting like a lot of sugar, and we are going to blend it again. Just a little bit. Yep. And we are going to add some. This is a dry milk powder. We are going to add dry milk powder. One, two, three, four, five. We are going to add bicarbonate of soda and I will add okay, this much and we will give it a mix blend everything I don't want it very thick, I want it a bit light. So here are around five, five to six spoons of flour and we will mix to see how it's looking. thicker not very thick which is perfect this one is perfect for the crepes so give it a final good mix 
So just we know there are no lumps inside. Just to make sure there are no lumps. <laughs> ready for this for the crepes so here is the consistency you can see it is not very thick not very watery it is kind of, it is kind of like a runny egg when you break an egg you will get this kind of consistency like this kind of butter we need for your crepes hello we are going to start cooking the crepes and you have to put oil on the top so the crepes won't stick so there is an oil brush, you can use this and you have to give it a whisk here, just a little bit and here is your measurement, one of this just put on the top, give it a quick spread The bottom of the crepe is cooking and if you try to lift that too early it will be very sticky. So you just have to wait a couple of seconds. Say around 30 to 40 seconds. And you can see it's not sticking anymore. And this is how you, you just go around. on the oil brush, brush it on the top so the crabs won't stick on the top and your butter, just give it a quick mix and here is your measurement, one scoop of this go like this and then you need your spoon and spread it around Then you just have to wait for around 30 to 40 seconds and you can see uh, as it is cooking the top of the crab is drying faster so when it's starting to dry a lot means the bottom is cooked so you have to turn the crab so now you see the top is drying and it's not sticky anymore so i will go around the crab just to make sure it's not sticky gently go under and turn it and that's how your crepe should look like. And give it a little tap just to make sure the, the crepe is cooking from, from the bottom. And you have to wait another 30 40 seconds. And, and after it will be ready. So I will show you how it will look like. The crab is ready here and the bottom is cooked so I will put it on the plate and here is your crab and they look very good very delicious for your breakfast or tea time you can have them with chocolate you can have them with fresh cream with some fruits with marmalade jam whichever way you fancy 
and they are really good so you should try them at home so you have to put oil on the top and get in the butter one scoop of this one that's your measurement you have to spread it around Now you just have to let it cook a little bit for around 30 to 40 seconds. And you can see the top of the crab is drying. So when it is drying, it means that the bottom is cooked. And just go around with this. So the crepes are cooked and now we are going to fill up the crepes and we will need cream and fresh fruits and some coconut, grated coconut to, to garnish on the top. Now we have fresh cream in the crepe and we are going to put some fruit. This one is going to be strawberry, strawberry and cream. Strawberries and cream this one. And this one is the raspberry, raspberry crab. The coconut is ready now. Now you can see the crepes are very beautiful, they are ready and one of them has cream and raspberries and the other has cream and strawberries. I hope you like this video, do try these crepes at home, try with your family and I hope you like these crepes. Please do subscribe to my channel and I will see you in the next video.